the internet's not going to like me after this one. Especially since this is more filler for my channel. God, I need more content. Alien vs. Predator Requiem follows up the last renowned Alien vs. Predator movie with the ship that leaves the Arctic and crashes on Earth because an a pred alien chestburster kills all the predators and goes on the rampage when it crashes in a small town and pretty much just unleashes a lot of aliens and a lot of chaos and one predator named Wolf has to go and stop them and wow wow the reviews for this is wow 10 percent on rotten tomatoes wow i don't get the reviews for it honestly i don't get it because in my opinion this movie is better than the first one in my opinion don't shoot me please but it is a lot better than the first one, I think, because I think the two main characters, uh, Dallas Howard and his brother, are a lot more relatable in real life. Because you got them just living their everyday lives, and it's interrupted by a bunch of xenomorphs invading the town and destroying everything. And, yeah, it, it, this movie goes full on, like... It kills babies full on. Legit, it kills babies. And you see the Pred Alien kill a hospital full of people, a whole town full of people. The Predator is just whacking off heads and Xenomorph heads. This movie just goes full blown insane and I love it, man. I love it. This is everything I wanted in an Alien vs. Predator movie because... What I expect from Alien vs. Predator, I don't expect it to be like, okay, are, are we, are we, um, are we getting to the Alien vs. Predator yet? I don't care about the characters, I just want to see Alien and Predator fighting, like a Godzilla movie. I just want to see monsters fighting. That's why I paid for it. Same thing about Transformers. I just want to see giant robots fight. And, and uh, having good characters is a plus, but I don't really care about them. And I just want to see aliens and predators fighting, and this is what we get. It goes full-blown insane. That R rating, man, goes a long way. And just the first shot you get, he, a little boy gets a chest burster popping out of his chest. It's like... Oh, wow, this isn't PG-13 anymore, folks. Uh, do people bring their dates to this? <laughs> and yeah, um, let's talk about the predator known as Wolf. Wow. He's just, wow, he is an awesome predator. He just stands up to the aliens. He's a lone wolf going out on the hunt, stop these things. He's pretty much the cleanup crew. He's like... The damage control of the MCU. He pretty much gets called in, handles everything, and yeah. And yeah, um, what was I going to say? Also, the Pred Alien, man. Awesome design. I love the Pred Alien. It's one of my favorite Alien vs. Predator creatures and alien type of creatures as well. But yeah. My only complaint, really main complaint about the movie is I would have... I don't like the how it ends. That's the only thing I don't like. I will tell you what I would have had for my ending after the movie because I want you guys to see this. It's actually a pretty good movie and turn on a light, someone. The movie is, there's a lot of complaints. Oh, the movie's too hard to see. There is a few shots that are extremely hard to see and you can't make out, but I can 
I can clearly make them out. I can see the scenes fine. Like, I can see, but... There's just a few scenes that are like, come on, man, I can't see. Show some fighting in them, but overall, guys, that's really my main complaint with Alien vs. Predator Requiem. It goes full-blown R, carnage, and just full-blown murderous, and just has a high body count for Alien vs. Predator movie, and it just... This is everything I wanted in Alien vs. Predator movie. And Wolf the Predator is awesome. And there's way more Alien vs. Predator action in this one than the first one. But overall, I'm giving Alien vs. Predator Requiem a B+. Yeah, guys, I really don't get the hate for this movie. It's enjoyable and fun to watch. But the only my real complaint is just the ending and this is how i would rewritten it because the movie ends off with pretty much a nuclear bomb blowing up the whole town it's like no oh, that's just oh that's just cheap so if i would have rewritten this movie this is how i would have ended it i would have ended up with wolf blowing up the whole town with nuking the whole town with the predator gear it's like okay Wolf is at a standstill with the Pred Alien, what would he do? Okay, nuke the whole town and clean up the whole thing. That's what any other Predator would do with in any other movies, but... Yeah, honestly, I would like that option a lot better than the government nuking it. Oh, It's an okay ending, but I liked my idea for ending better. But yeah, that's all for this time. Punch that like button face like boss. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!